Hey guys, I hope you're having an awesome, awesome Friday. I am not going to show my face because I have just endured the pouring rain trying to get all of this, this stuff in. So, I'm just going to go over this really quick. Um, this is from Sam's. This is on Friday. Tomorrow, um, I'm going to be going to Walmart since I can't go to Aldi's this week because um, my in-laws are coming in. So, I'm just going to share this real quick. So, we got two packs of the 24-pack um, Red Bulls. These were $34 and some change. Got another of these um, really good-sized box of Cheez-Its, um, 45 pouches. We still have some from last month, but not very many. This was $10, so it's a really good deal on that. And they're the um, pretty decent-sized bags. They're not the teeny-tiny bags. And then... Um, Got two cases of this purified Maker's Mark water, the 40 count. These were about three dollars, they're right under three dollars and fifty cents um, per pack. And then we tried this last month this um, Palermo's um, thin crust pepperoni pizza, it's really really good. Um, these were right under ten dollars, I think nine dollars and 72 cents. So I got two packs of those, and they come with three of them in there. And then I got a four pack of the Jacks, and that is about the same price, right under $10 as well. And then I got two cases of the Blue Moon. This was $13.72. And it's pretty good because normally at the store they're about um they're about a dollar more. They're about $14 and some change at Walmart. So that is everything I got. It came up to right under $150, which was um, I think it was like one fifty nine oh two or something. Um, so that is all I got today. I will be back um, to show you guys tomorrow um, everything that I got at Walmart. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey guys, happy Saturday! Look what I have for you. Yes, it is my monthly grocery haul. So I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm gonna turn you guys around. Um, today, let's see, this morning my in-laws came in and we went out to lunch and then, um, <clears throat> my mom came and she always usually accompanies me with, um, or she has been lately with my monthly grocery shopping. I think she finds it somewhat, um, amusing. So, um, I wasn't able to actually go to Aldi's like I wanted because our Aldi's is about an hour away from where I am. So I had to um, go to Walmart instead. And I could definitely tell a price difference. Um, so hopefully next month I can go back to Aldi's. But I want to show you guys what I got this month. And this was from Walmart. <clears throat> so here is everything that I got. Um, well, this is mostly everything. I have just a few things in the hallway. Um, but this was $236, which you guys know normally when I load up the table like this at Aldi's, it's about $130. So definitely a um, substantial price difference on that. But I did get my husband a few more things than I normally do. So I'm going to go ahead and get into it. And yes, for those of you who enjoy seeing Holly's face, there she is. She is so tired today. Um, anyways... So, for my husband's lunches, I picked up these Smuckers and Crustables. Um, this was right under $6. I picked up some of the steak, um, Philly cheese steak meat. Um, this was $7.14. I'm making Philly cheese steaks this month. Picked up some more Texas um, cheese and garlic toast. <clears throat> some great value honey nut cream cheese. This is for my blueberry bagels. This was $1.76. Some pepperoni because we're making homemade um, pizzas of course you guys know we're pizza obsessed but this was two dollars picked up this two pack of great value cream cheese I'm going to be making a celebratory debt free um, cake so yes that will be included with that so this was a dollar seventy six picked up some seasoned fries I believe these are a dollar seventy six as well some waffle fries, these were $1.84, and I think the wedges were $1.84 too, so I got two packs of those. Picked up some spicy chicken patties for my husband, some chicken sandwiches, some, oh, I'm sorry, that was a, um, right under $6, popcorn chicken, this was $4.12. Um, here are my blueberry bagels, these were about $1.50, I think. Um, 
And then I got some Colby um, and Monterey Jack cheese. This was $3.52. Some mozzarella cheese. That was $3.52 as well. This roll of ground turkey. This was $7 and I think 30 cents. I picked up four of these packs of the Pepper Jack um, sliced cheese, the 10 slices, and for $1.92. Picked up some of this Koneka um, hot and spicy um, hickory smoked sausage. This is going to be for the jambalaya and gumbo. This was $5 or $4.48. Picked up two of these Philly cheesesteak pizzas. These were $4.48 as well. Picked up some beef and cheddar wraps. Um, there are four of them in here. This was a, right under $5, and I'm hoping that um, he will like them. We have never had these before, so hopefully he does. Picked up some little Smokies. These were $2.50 for cocktail weenies. Some um, all-natural sour cream. This was a dollar. I picked up some Reese's. Yes, this was a splurge. Um, this was $5.28, which is a lot. It is, um, but like I said, it was a splurge. So, picked up some of these cage-free eggs. This was um, right under $3. Some flour tortillas. That was $1.58. I picked up some of this Old El Paso Bold Nacho Cheese Tacos. These are so good. And they were um, right under $2.00. Picked up some ranch as well. So yummy. Remind me of the um, like Dorito um, tacos and stuff from Taco Bell. This um, picked up some pizza crust. We've never used this kind before. And it does say um, thick crust, which we don't really like thick crust. So maybe I can roll it out a little bit. But hopefully it'll be good. Um, and this is $1.88. So I picked up two of those for homemade pizzas. Of course, some more pizzas. Um, this was $3 and I think like $3.80 or so. Um, and I got two of those, some um, pepperoni and sausage and then three meat. Picked up this value pack of these toaster strudels. These were $2, or I'm sorry, $3.52. Picked up this giant bag of Totino's pizza rolls. These were um, nine, $8.70. I'm sorry, $8.98, I believe. Picked up some large cooked shrimp. This was $7. Picked up some of these mustard greens, which I love. These were um, $2. Some nacho um, chicken and cheese bites. These were $5. Picked up some more of the beef and cheddar ballpark um, microwaveable patties. These were $8. Picked up some Texas peat honey mustard. Um, I think it's about two dollars, and then some honey barbecue sauce that was a dollar. Some gumbo mix. This was a dollar fifty-eight, and jambalaya with cheese a dollar fifty-eight as well. Then I picked up these double zipper um, mega pack for the gallon freezer bags. These were two ninety-eight. Also picked up some quart size um, seventy-five count for two dollars and ninety-eight cents as well. Picked up some Milo's tea. My husband was talking about that earlier, and they just built a Milo's where we are. Um, so that was $3. And I'm going to show you guys the last little bit. Please excuse my house. is so messy. Picked up two more cases of the Sam Adams. These were $16 a piece, the Boston Lager. We needed one more of the 12-pack of Red Bull. That was $18.72. And then Great Value Paper Towels, which I'm so excited about because these used to be $14.96 and they were $12.12, which is really weird, but I will take it. So that is everything um, that I got this month for groceries, guys. So I hope you enjoyed the haul. This is for the month of May, um, which is going to be the most exciting month we've had since I've been on YouTube. So I'm super excited. And I am so thankful for you guys. Thank you guys so much for hanging in there with me. Sorry about my hand just then. Um, I appreciate you guys more than you know. And I'm so excited for just the things that are coming up. So thank you guys so much for following me. And I hope you guys are doing awesome on your journeys. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.